Sagan. What is going on guys and girls, Kate and K here at your service and today what we're going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you how to acquire the Wrath of the Ancients or Bow and the Black Ops 3 Awakening DLC, the Eisendrach. Now just like in Black Ops 2, Mob of the Dead, you have to feed dogs or in this case we have dragons. Now there's three dragons located in the map and I'm gonna be showing you guys the most effective way acquiring the Wrath of the Ancients by rung 5 or 6. Now what you wanna do is you wanna at the start of the round you wanna acquire as much points as possible and then you wanna call the gondola or tram and acquire a max ammo or double points or insta kill whatever it may be so you can uh, maximize those points as possible then what you're gonna do i don't want you guys purchase any weapons yet just hold on you gotta buy the door on your right this is the best route in order to get the wrath of the ancients as fast as possible you're gonna buy the door on the right then you're gonna buy the door next to double tap then you're gonna run and go to the first dragon on your left when you're coming in and where there's a electric door that you have to turn on with the power for it to open so you want to kill one zombie it takes about eight to ten zombies to feed each dragon and for them to be completely full how you know when it's full it will breed fire then it will crumble to rocks now if you guys find that the mystery box is that location i recommend not buying the mystery box because i have tried to buy the mystery box several times and have got trash weapons such as the gorgon or the, the sniper s vg and it's just terrible so what i recommend you guys doing is buying the vmp from off the wall and that if you guys experience with zombies and you have the vmp level up it will be a good weapon of choice it can last you a long time or about wrong 20 if you pack a punch so after the dragon is full you're gonna go towards the power you have to pass you dr max's room and samantha and you just want to accumulate enough points to open the door towards the power you're gonna go towards the power you're gonna open it and then you're gonna go straight towards the main courtyard and the, you're gonna go towards the room with the computers you're gonna do the same process what you did towards the dragon you're gonna kill about eight zombies eight to ten zombies should be fine and he should breathe fire when you complete the amount of zombies you have to kill and then he's gonna crumble into rocks so you should save a couple zombies during that round then you can carry them downstairs to the main room where the pyramid is and feed the last dragon now you have to feed these dragons really slowly because they take a while to consume each zombies and eat them so after that is done after the last dragon is finished eating the, each zombie you want to go towards the tombstone and that will be your wrath of the ancients ready to go it's a very good weapon It's actually easier to acquire than the staff from oranges if you guys remember back in black ops 2 it's very easier to acquire it lasts a good amount of rounds and i'm gonna be having some more videos up pretty soon to show you guys how to upgrade the wrath of the ancients to the different elements which will be pretty effective uh, whenever you play this map you have to if you want to make it file you, you have to acquire the wrath of the ancient or the upgraded version so thank you guys for watching like subscribe comment and i'll see you guys in another video